welcome. Happy birthday to you. Gemini's. Oh my God, Gemini's. Let's go in and see what's happening for you, Gemini's. Alrighty. So this, um, this is your birthday readings, Gemini's, and it is from the the 8th until the 14th, Gemini's. The 8th until the 14th. So whatever is transpiring and is happening, you have stability. A whole lot of stability is going to be coming up for you, Gemini's. Okay, so this is just going to be wonderful. A whole lot of stability is coming up for you, Gemini. So um, a really wonderful energy. You have the energy of the world that is going to be um, bringing you balance. Um, however, this is happening and transpiring um, the energy of this world is going to bring in a lot of stability and a lot of balance for you, um, Gemini's. Okay, so I see a lot of uh, stuff is going to be transpiring and happening. I love the energy of the world, especially for you, Gemini's, because of uh, whatever um, deceptive uh, situation that is happening and transpiring. Um, you're going to be realizing that life is... Uh, Going to be changing for a lot of you Gemini's however this is happening in transpiring and um, it is in a positive way because you're going to be able um, to get out of certain issues and situations um, that you were going through okay so um, it is absolutely good for you Gemini's and I'm sorry <laughs> I'm pulling out your cards Gemini so that's the reason I have to I'm not looking at you guys but um, yeah so um i love this energy for you guys whatever the issue and the situation is whatever is transpiring um i see truths are going to be out and this is going to be absolutely absolutely um fabulous okay so this is um going to be a good year whatever is transpiring it's about a cycle is over new beginnings is coming in you're going to be overcoming whatever issues and situation you were dealing with which is um, very, very positive and good aligned with positive energies. So that is um, absolutely fabulous. All right, Gemini. So um, let's give your cards a shuffle. Um, we're going to give your cards a shuffle to see what is coming up to help you. Um, give you a sense of meaning going um, forward in this year. Okay, so... Um, we have shuffled your cards and um, remember it is um, this um, year reading is from the 8th until the 14th okay I love you Gemini's let's see what is going to be coming up for you guys my hair is wet so if it looks a little bit I had to wet it in order for it to stay so Gemini's we have uh, for the people on the eight we have the wheel of fortune so this is uh, um really wonderful with the energy of the wheel of fortune this is absolutely fabulous now what we have working for you guys is that we have the three of pentacles so the wheel of fortune is bringing back some money that was either lost stolen or some deceptive play with some money the wheel of fortune is bringing that if you were in a connection and you broke up, uh, the Wheel of Fortune could be bringing back this person and this situation in your life in order for you to resolve it. Uh, what else is coming up is that I see the energy of the Six of Cups. So um, friends who you have ended relationships with or connection with could be returning in your life. And this is going to be good. Um, because uh, it's as if you need to heal a karmatic issues with these people so that you can move on okay so however this is coming up and transpiring is that there are issues and situation that you need to heal with these people so that you can um, move forward so I see friends could be returning in your life okay the six of cups is the energy where friends um, um, you know people who you were um with who you were friends with they are going to be returning in your life 
so um it is um good whatever that was lost i see it's going to be returned to you and this is going to be um positive so whatever that was lost for you gemini's um um this is going to be returning um to you and it is going to be absolutely absolutely um brilliant okay so um sometimes life has its um ups and down but uh, um, this is going to be in a very very positive way um, and uh, um, with the wheel of fortune with everything in balance it's actually a very 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 beautiful message okay it's an absolutely um, beautiful message with these two energies so what you have with the wheel of fortune I see money is going to be coming in so this is what I was saying money that was stolen in the past is going to be returning for you Gemini's in the present okay so this is going to be a good year for the people who were born I see for you men and you businessmen people situations is going to be returning in your life okay so for you men and businessmen people and situation is going to be returning in your life whatever that was happening and transpiring I see that some of you um, especially men i see um unexpected returning of people and situations in your life okay so be aware of that for the people who were born on the the eight it's a year of um financial money is returning to you and i see that uh, um people um that you had issues with in the past is going to be returning so we're moving on to the people who were born on the ninth, and you have the energy of the sun so success is coming in and this is going to be wonderful and positive and wonderful success is here for you people who were born on the night and this is good because you if you are you were not feeling well your energy was down you have been going through things i see you're going to be extremely successful um at this time because you're going to be really finding out and seeing and understanding um, that things is about to change so a whole lot of success so if you're doing an exam if you're finishing off some studies if you want the promotions this year with a world and the Sun it is absolutely absolutely fabulous okay so go for it so what we're going to be dealing with here we have the four of Pentacles so um, with the Sun and the four of Pentacles is always a successful um with money successfully building back your financial stability this is going to be good um, um your fear is going to be released you are going to be building back a strong financial stability and you're going to be winning money so it's going to be a very lucky year for you guys uh, when it comes on to money okay then um ooh, la la then we have the energy of the ten of pentacles for you guys so it is it's, it's all about the money this year money 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 very successful so it, it's going to be a lucky year when it comes on to money and wealth um, for you people who were born on the night is a very very promising year where financial success and ability financial ways of uh, building on your financial stability is going to be coming in and it's going to be coming in in a wonderful way some of you could be writing book or inventing something that is going to be creating a lot of wealth for you so you could be writing a book or you could be finding out about ways of manifesting financial stability in your world and this is going to be good because I see that whatever um, that you're inventing okay so you could be inventing something and th that's what I also say with studies some of you are going to be finishing your study and get a job immediately I see an end is coming to hardship with your financial stability also so whoever that was going through some hardship with your financial stability an end is going to be coming in and this is going to be absolutely absolutely fabulous so this is a completely satisfactory here for the people who were born on the ninth we're looking at the people who were born on the tenth you have the energy of the moon now with the energy of the moon you Virgos I see you're going to be um, aware of certain things that was going that you were not aware of so it's a lot of information that was kept from you is going to be coming out or you are going to be um, it's as if invisible 
um, you receive information that you were not aware of and this is going to be absolutely absolutely fabulous um, because the energy of the moon is also that you are removing people your enemies people that was blocking you people that was deceiving you you're removing these people and um, making way okay so whoever you were dealing with a young Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person um, whoever that was blocking your financial stability whoever that was keeping you away um, from um, financial um, stability and the flow of your stability you're removing these people in this year out of your life okay so I see um, that um, whatever that was lost um, when it comes on to um, business work um, um, anything to do with your um, financial stability and whatever that was lost and whoever was keeping you from this um, a Pisces cancer and a scorpion so this could be some of you are dealing with issues where you were dealing with an old boss and a, um, a old boss and, and a young person who has created some obstacles in your life and I see you're tearing these people and situation out of your life for once and for all and you're re resolving it in a very positive way and it's as if you're saying I am taking I'm ending the cycle with you people and I'm taking back my life so whoever um, these two people was a Pisces cancer scorpion whoever these sort of energy is where I see it, you're going to be giving a lot of love also you're going to be opening up your heart to love and this is going to be good but I see you're thinking back on the past where it was good but now you have to look at the future so I see conflicts I see some of you are going to be having conflicts with a young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person whoever this person is and whatever that is transpiring but it could be conflicts with losing a job and you know you want to re um, you know re and cap with this job and it is as if uh, you have inner conflicts and you need to let go and look forward I see a transition that is coming up uh, um, um, if you're in a relationship or business dealings or it could be your father a transition is coming up for this person whether this person is a transition is coming up I see an end is coming up I see relationships could be ending with the water sign and the earth sign people however this is happening and transpiring in your world because I see you're going to be finding out some secrets about a young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person and some secrets about a Pisces cancer or a scorpion man so whoever these people it could be your, your father and your sisters or brother or your father and your mother and your sisters and brother there's a lot of conflicts and I see you're going to be ending these issue and situation because you realize that these people weren't for you but against you so we're moving on to the people who were born on the 11th and you have your own energy vibration with a world it's about go 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 the green light is here go 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 this is wonderful this is positive it is a yes for anything that you decide to do in this year it's going to be a yes you're going to be having everything that you need um, to use to create your wealth it's a yes go ahead um, this is going to be an absolutely absolutely positive year for you with financial wealth and abundance so it's a it's a year that is saying yes go for it go for anything that you wanted um, to um, resist whatever the hardship is you're going to be getting out of the hardship in this year okay so whoever that was going through any hardship you have and you're going to be using the tool that you have in order to release you from hardships whatever hardships that you have been going through you have all the tool and you're using them and you're releasing yourself from some deceptive um, it could be deceptive but it could be just hardship sometimes we imprison ourselves in a deceptive play and um, this is what is going to be transpiring some of you or could be having some issues with a business this is going to be resolved um, and this is going to be good whatever studies you're doing whatever you're doing for work or creating for yourself I see a lot of you could be either writers or bloggers or so but it's going to be very 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 successful so I see communication whatever you're doing with media and that sort of a thing communication is very very successful and this is going to be helping some of you 
um, to um, heal um, whatever hardship, whether financial hardship or in a little personal hardship, it's going to be good. Um, I'd advise you guys to go and listen to the full moon reading because the full moon reading, um, somehow the full moon reading have information that is going to be helping you out. And it is good to collaborate the full moon reading. So if you're not a member yet, it's good um, to collaborate. So I see some stress, uh, hardship and stress, and you're going to be coming out of this. So whoever that was in hardship and stress, uh, you're going to be coming out of this. Okay. And whatever that was happening where people were stealing from you, I see you're going to be finding out and you're going to be resolving the situation because some of you had a feelings that you, um, people were stealing from you. And I see that this uh, is going to be, uh, um, coming out and you're going to be finding out is somehow you find ways and means of seeing what was going on behind the scenes and you're going to be finding out. So, the stress is going to be over in this year. Whatever that was stressing you out, whatever that was transpiring, the stress is going to be over. Whoever that was stealing from you, a block is going to be placed on this person. However, it was transpiring. Some of you, it was um, a Taurus that was doing it. And I see justice came down on this Taurus. Whatever um, a Taurus has done to some of you, I see justice is going to be coming down on this person. It could be a boss. Um, so whoever this person is that some of you had some issues with, whether it was a business partner, a relative, I see they put a block on this person, okay? So whoever this person is and whatever that was transpired, they have put a block on this person. Wow. So communication is going to be the key, and I see you have your own energy vibration. So communication is definitely going to be the key because it is going to be bringing out a lot of information and 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 pushing you to um a better place okay so this year is like you're taking away and moving away obstacles and people out of your way so 12 um the people who are born on the 12 i see a transition is coming up so the world the world and and debt is uh, and it's coming to a, a issue, a situation, a transition that is coming up in your life. And this is going to be very wonderful and very positive. So what we're seeing here is that there is some deceptive or there was some issues that you were dealing with. And the world is bringing a cycle and end to this issue and is bringing transition in your life. And this is going to be good. Okay. So. Let's look at what is going to be ending in your life. I see the energy of uh, um, this person is a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion. Whoever this person is, it could be relationships also because this is the energy of love. Um, so some relationships could be ending. Um, a relationship between you and um, someone that is of a water sign. Some emotion situation that you are going through is going to be ending okay so whatever is transpiring definitely um that is going to be ending and i see you are going to be receiving some good good news so it's as if a cycle is coming um and it's over and it could be a marriage it could be um some conflict in relationships that you have been dealing with someone who were standing in your way, whoever this person is and whatever that was transpiring. It is a very deceptive person who has been creating some issues and standing in your way. And it's as if the universe come in and says, uh, this is now over. So you're going to be realizing that in this year, it's as if the universe is going to be coming in and is going to be shifting the energy where, um, it's like, okay, um, you have clear your karma with this person it is time for you to move on okay so whoever this person is and whatever is happening and transpiring is that you have really shift your life and remove um whatever that was happening with um a partner a family member um, and I see changes is coming up. So, um, some of you could have been dealing with a deceptive, 
um, person who have created some issues. So it could be a situation where there was um, um, where there was um, an ex boss or that sort of a situation or an ex partner that was creating some issues in your world. I see this person is uh, end has come to this person. Truth came out about what has transpired and they and this situation is being transformed and ended and this is good so wonderful so i see that definitely this was an old boss or someone in that was using their powers over you and this is now ended because whatever this person has done it could be a father figure it could be someone who was molesting you it could be someone who has created some real issues in your world and i see that this is now over so whatever has transpired i see um this issue and this situation is as if you're taking back your power or people in power is seeing what has transpired and how a this uh, um an ex boss or someone who um overgone your boundaries and it is going to be resolved and i see you're going to be receiving some good news coming to you okay so this is really really positive so it is going to be a good year because the cycle is going to be over with some issues that you have in the past with um someone who has created some obstacles and and, and use their power in order um, to create havoc in your life. And I see resolution is going to be coming in um, in, in this year. Okay, so we're moving on to the people who were born on the 13th. We have the Eye Princess. So some of you are going to be um, receiving inner wisdom and guidance. And this is as if uh, um, it is time for you to understand why you're here, who you are, and um, what is transpiring in your world and as, it's as if the universe is just going to be opening up for you possibilities of showing you and giving you information and your deities are going to be working with you to offer you some form of positivity in your world in order to access um, the state of your ability and this is going to be good because um, Gemini's you are really really smart people and this is going to be helping you to move forward so it is being protected by two sort of energy where balance is being brought in and wisdom and understanding you're going to be receiving I see an offer is coming up for you guys and this is an offer of accepting the spirituality and the inner wisdom but also whatever you want if you want a new house a new car um, property um, whatever you want is going to be granted by the eye princess because uh, they have seen how you have uh, take care of yourself and get to this place in your life and she is going to be coming up and uh, offering you it's as if your deities is going to be offering you whatever that you want uh, I see um, seven of ones. You're going to be standing your ground this year, and this is going to be good. Um, you guys are really going to be standing your grounds and letting people know um, to so far and no further. Whatever is happening and transpiring, I see a lot of you really standing your grounds and saying to people, I have had enough. I am not going to take any more BS. You're standing and protecting yourself and your family and I see um, business new deals um, some of you are going to be receiving ideas to um, 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 uh, get, um, create um, create new things um, you're going to be inventing things and this is going to be good so however this is transpiring a lot of invention and I see you standing your grounds I see you're really standing your grounds when it comes on um, to people and situation in your world because you're showing people I'm taking back my power so it's as if wisdom and understanding peace is going to be coming in so this is good um, the eye princess so they're going to be offering you peace so peace in your world um, if you if you were always your mind was always busy they're going to give you peace okay so a lot of Gemini's have this where your mind is always busy always busy going so far and you're going to be now having peace in your 
in your mind peace in yourself and this is going to be good so it is going to be a powerful wor uh, um, um, year because it's a year where um, they're, they're going to be offering you and when you get the offer of peace and a new start peace and a new start I see if some of you wanted to have a child the opportunity is going to be here um, definitely if some of you want to have a child I see the opportunity is definitely going to be here doors of opportunity is going to be opening and opportunity is going to be here so this is going to be good whatever that was happening and transpiring I see peace calm to a situation and I see new doors of opportunities is going to be opening for you a lot of new doors um, I see a lot of you are going to be receiving help just unexpected help just people are just coming to you and just really really helping you out unexpected help is going to be coming in and uh, if some of you were trying to get pregnant i see this year is going to be healing you as you look to the end of the year you could be getting pregnant okay so this is good it's a really powerful year it's as if you're taking back your power it's as if the universe is granting you the release of taking back your power and this is very good now we're moving on to the people who were born on the sixth On the 14th the people who are born on the 14th you receive the energy of the week this is the energy of the um, the old year for you guys you are balanced by the hurt the world okay so it's as if balance in every form and every way is going to be coming back to each and every one of you so you get uh, and you are going to be so the people who are born on the 14 what is going to be happening and transpiring is that you people are going to be helping out the rest of the sign the rest of these people from the 8 until um, the 14 you're going to be helping out all of them with your energy that is coming in a cycle is going to be broken and new love is going to be coming in Wow 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 absolutely absolutely fabulous so whatever that was transpiring and whatever that was happening around you guys is like the universe they're going to be breaking the cycle so if you are in a bad relationship if you were having issues on the work floor if you were having issues in a family whatever was transpiring a cycle is broken and I see um, love is coming in um, new love is coming in whatever is happening and transpiring I see the deceptiveness is now over people are now seeing the truth to the deceptiveness I see a cycle is over where the deceptiveness is now over some of you be careful of a new love coming in your life this person could stab you in your back later so this is a year um, where truths are coming out and deceptiveness people who are not speaking the truth is going to come to an end um, people who have stabbed you in the back in the past is going to come to an end new love is here and whatever the destructiveness is be aware of this because what is coming up is that oh a new um, offer is going to be coming in for you so whatever is transpiring a new offer um, some of you are going to be getting married new love is coming in um, a new um, um, business agreement new contract new partnership uh, um, a cycle is over and a new cycle directly is going to be beginning with the, the ace of cups so this is good a lot of marriage a lot of people are going to be thinking about marrying or moving in together so this is absolutely absolutely um, fabulous and I see a new offer is going to be coming in for you where some of you could be going overseas to work some of you could be um, as a scene and find out some lies and deceptiveness that was uh, um, overseas and you could have bring this to light I see new start for some of you in another um, location a relocation is coming up but it is going to be positive um, however this relocation is and however this relocation is coming up it's going to be um, very very positive okay so however um, this uh, situation is happening and transpiring it's going to be positive so I see a new offer is going to be coming in a new offer is going to be um, coming up and a new offer 
of um, a new start somewhere else, okay? Um, relocation, new business um, in another city, in another state. It's going to be absolutely, absolutely fabulous. So um, there is, there was, and there is, um, there was, and there is some um, sort of a deceptiveness um, that was happening in another place, in another city that has to, that affected you guys um, who were born on the 14th. And I see truths are going to be coming out in this year. But I see for you guys is that as an, an cycle is broken, a new start is going to be coming up and people are going to be seeing and understanding what is coming out. So you are being guarded. Whatever is happening and transpiring, you're being guarded. Um, this is going to be a good year for you guys. And remember, whatever happens um, to the people on um, the first date of this year for you guys, we're 8 to 14. You all are going to be feeling the energies and this is going to be absolutely, absolutely fabulous. Okay, so um, wonderful energy, wonderful situation. Um, however, this is playing out. However, this is transpiring. Wonderful, wonderful um, situation that is happening and transpiring. So there is definitely some good news um, that is going to be happening and transpiring. And I see materialistic wealth is also going to be coming in for a lot of you. I am wishing you wonderful, um, positive life, um, however this may be. Um, thank you so much. Please share, share, share these videos. Go and listen to the weekly readings because these are for the year. Right after your birthday, you're going to be seeing all of these shift of energies is coming up. It is good. You can still order a birthday reading because what will happen and transpire is that um, I can still do your birthday for the coming year because right after your birthday is where the ship of energy begins. I love you guys. Um, like and share these videos and we'll speak to you next week.